don't need your help. I can quit any time. I don't have a problem. Listen, it's just a game, alright? This is a much more serious problem than many people believe. Many people have lost their jobs because of their dependency of solitaire. They've lost their families, and even their pets. Today, Robin Polson is the director of the American Institute Against Solitaire Dependency. I myself lost my job because of my addiction. And I started this program because, one, I didn't have a job, and two, it was the right thing to do. While you're at home, we took our camera into one of their sessions to see firsthand how this program Fight affected the lives Fight of its participants. Ryan was a first-time visitor at this session. Damien had many family problems due to solitaire. Wow. And Lisa uh, well, had been institutionalized three times. Lisa. My name's Ryan, but um, I'm not here because I'm addicted. I'm just here because Damien wanted me to show up. But, uh, We've all been there, Ryan. It's okay. I, I used to say that, too. It's okay, Ryan. Ryan was in denial at the beginning. I play solitaire two hours a day, maybe, on my computer. Sometimes till my fingers bleed. But I'm not addicted to it. Ryan grew hostile as the evening progressed. This is ridiculous. You people aren't really addicted to solitaire. There's just no way. Have you ever played solitaire? I play solitaire a lot on my computer, but I'm not anywhere near being addicted. That's, that's what I said. You're wasting your time when you play solitaire, my friend. I don't know why I came to this. I really don't understand this at all. How many hours? Okay, Damien, how did you deal with your with your problem with solitaire? Well, really, it really was me. It was my mom. mom. Good. And she she saw me one day playing solitaire, and the next day she saw me playing solitaire. And the next day, she saw me playing solitaire. And she took me, she took me to my father and she told me to tell him what I was doing. And that's all I can remember. In this exercise, the patients were required to point the mouse at the solitaire icon without clicking. Your addiction. This is a big mountain that you have. It and was only a matter of time for Damien. Don't. His aren't going to get that far. Damien! Damien! Oh! Oh, Damien! No! I'm so weak. My mom is going to hate, hate, hate me. She'll never know. We won't tell her. You're going to tell my mom. Will you all remember for me, please? That the computer is not the enemy. The computer's not to blame. You are not to blame for this. It's not your fault. Bill Gates is the enemy. The most touching part of the evening came when everyone shared how their lives had been changed by this program. I'm passing my classes. I'm not getting kicked out of the computer lab because they know that I can do it. I won't play solitaire all the time. And my family likes me again. Repeat after me. My name is Ryan Koontz. My name is Ryan Koontz. And I am a solitaire addict. And I am a solitaire addict. We asked Robin what she would like to say to anyone who might be a solitaire addict. If you or anyone you know has this problem, give us a call. We can help. 1-800-U-R-L-O-S-E-R. -E Please give us a call. We are here for you. Let us help. I know you can. You guys are strong.